Grief is the natural, emotional way we respond to loss and death. If you're in the middle of your own loss because of a death, you might ask yourself, why are you experiencing so much pain and why is your life in such chaos? Loving someone creates an attachment to that person at a very deep emotional and unconscious level. When that person is suddenly gone, you are left feeling like you yourself have been torn asunder. The morning of the funeral, the house was a scramble when my seven-year-old son Jesse announced that the funeral limo was here to pick us up. We all scrambled out the door and into the limo, but I felt compelled to return to the house. I made up an excuse and said I forgot something, and I ran back into the now silenced home. And I listened for her, but she wasn't there. And at the top of my lungs, I yelled her name out as I felt my heart rip apart. But the silence swallowed my voice, leaving me quaking in my painful stillness. Death is one of the most traumatic experiences anyone can ever, can, can, can ever encounter. The cost of loving is pain. And the cost of our humanity and loving is, is pain. If grief is a function of attachment, then as we begin to invest ourselves in another person, we allow ourselves to become vulnerable to loss. Simply stated, if we choose to love, we choose to grieve. Grief is an inevitable part of life. Death can slam you fast and hard.